you are worth more than any sight. I gave my newly married husband to Blackwood to become what I am today. Now take a very good look at me at my age. I am so rich, very influential, and I travel around the world at my will. I own over 10 houses in Lagos, Otakot, and Abuja. And as a devoted member of Blackwood, I can marry as many husbands as I want. And of course, from them we Well, as for me, my husband and I gave out our first son to Blackwood. Then he was a pharmacist in a private hospital. But today, as we can all see, he's a commissioner of health. We are so rich, so rich that nobody questions our charity in the government department. I never regret being a member of Black Food. It's my life. She has become, she has become blind. blind. She gave, she gave her, her sight to set you. I gave my husband to black blind. We become what I am today. Now, now, since you can have a very good look at me, I am so rich. I am so rich. Anyone who has a request to make to the Supreme One of the Black Hood. I want the Supreme One to make me rich and influential. I want to 
Make a promise within your heart to the Supreme One. soul as you desire. Black Hood. And they had finished as in, you know, Monday, Tuesday, to Sunday. Sunday. So, uh, when they gave birth to the eighth one, mm -hmm. then I asked the man, what name will this one be? Ah, the man, <laughs> the man thought about it. He said, uh, the name will be public on this. <laughs> you kill me in this house.
Angela. Junior. Or oh, you push should be fast now. We are late. Put Dr. Bobby will soon, they will soon finish his birthday party and he won't be happy if we're not there on time. Angela! Junior! Several in my dream, attacking my son, and in different ways. I don't know what that means, but I know one thing very well. What? That danger is locking around the corner of my house. The time has come. Time for what? Time for sacrifice. What sacrifice? The sacrifice you promised to make to the Supreme One of the Black Hood. If you're made wealthy and influential. But the Supreme One has already taken my first son. Just about a week after I made the promise and request. The Supreme One did not take your son. Your son died a natural death. You're confusing me, Great One. I'm sorry. For everyone used as a sacrifice to the Supreme One of the Black Hood, we take his or her blood and heart. Did we take your son's blood or pluck off his heart? Great one, we have to reconsider this situation because I have no more child to give. I have only one child 
and there is no way I will let him die. Watch your tongue, Mr. Jack. Watch your tongue before you incur the wrath of the Supreme One of the Black Hood upon yourself. Is there no other way we can handle this? There is no other way. No other way. You must fulfill the pledge which you've made to the Black Hood. The time has come. Time for sacrifice. Sacrifice. The sacrifice you promised to make to the Supreme One of the Black Hood. If you're made wealthy and influential. can never happen. I'd rather die than let them have my soul. My first soul even died. What did they do to our lives? for the world then eh? and who will inherit this money after our death you called this pathetic see there is nothing pathetic about this I and my husband will never sacrifice my only son to the black hood even if heaven will never never 
You are challenging your God to a wrestling bout, and this is not too good. I understand how you feel, but you have to take heart and do it. Do it. Sacrifice my own son. Viens! Viens! Take me out of this! We tried our possible best to convince them, but without success. All they kept saying was that they sacrificed their first child to the Supreme One. Great one. They insisted that they would not bring the boy for any sacrifice. Instead, they opted to pay any amount as compensation. You won't believe it, Great One. The wife denounced her members right before us. Yes, she did. Tragedy. Tragedy shall befall them. They will come begging for the child to be sacrificed. That is if they will be alive. Leave them. Leave them to the supreme one of the black hood. Such I think they deserve everything they get for being stubborn. I knew it. I knew it would come to this. Thing to make you happy. 
and that's why I don't want you to continue with your education here in Nigeria. We've made arrangements to take you and Angela over to London so that you can continue your education there. But I like my school, that's where I want to continue. But the educational system here has collapsed. Not with all these incessant strikes. I don't want your education to be interrupted anymore. Do not argue with Daddy again, okay? Daddy has good plans for you. And you know we love you so much.
you know where you are and before whom you stand? Where are we? Whom do we stand before him? Officer, raise this man. Don't allow him to confuse his evil charms. <laughs> may I know who you are, young man? Yes, you may, old man. My name is Emeka Osondu. I am Charles Osondu's younger brother. Do all you told to practically give you everything he has worked for in his life so I can cure him of his ailments. After everything, he died. <laughs> Just wait a minute, young man. The man surrendered his wealth to God and not to me. Just two plots of land at Abuja, two houses in Lagos, and one in Port Harcourt. Is that too much for one to do for God? Shut up, my friend. His family doesn't live in a rented apartment. Look, officer, you don't mean you want to arrest me. You can't do that to a man of God. I want my husband's car back. I still can't complain how I gave out that car to him in the first place. The whole thing is still very confusing. But that's not the issue now. I want that car back before he comes home this month. I don't know what she's talking about. Who you is don't she? know what. Reverend, you don't know my own husband's car. You don't know what I'm talking about. You will know. Can you say he has been amassing all his wealth? I promise you will not get away with this this time. And everybody must hear about this. Uh, look, look, uh, we, 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 we can settle this, yeah? Don't I listen to him, oh! Settle what? Look, look uh, it's all right. It's all it's right. We'll settle it at the station. Wait. No, let him give me my car before we get no, to the we'll station. No, we'll settle that at the let, station. No, Wait a minute. We will settle that at the station. I will return everything. And I will even add to it. don't seem to understand what's going on anymore. I don't know. Have we in any way offended the spirit of the Black Hood? If we have, please tell us so we can appease it. Because we all seem to be having one problem or the other. Please. Great one. Just last two weeks, two cheap blows up. Got some my only house in Botaco was gotten by fire last week. I am finished. All my members are gone. I can't perform miracles any longer. All my members are taking back what they gave me as gifts. Some are even threatening to jail me. Look at my own situation. My pastor is building in Victoria and collapsed on Monday. I can't. Even those of us in government are facing proof and retirement threats. Great one. Something has to be done. Why? 
I took the great one. Who brought you? I, great one. You. Whatever affects the nose affects the eyes. Count your teeth with your tongue. Our next meeting shall be at the Holy of Holies. That good. Like you and your brother were not on good terms when he was still alive. Jack! Jack was a very big businessman and contractor. But so selfish, he never helped anybody. Look at me, just look at me. See how I'm living. Jack never helped any of us. Um, what about his son, Junior? Yes. Uh, he is with my younger sister, Ngozi, for the meantime. But Angela was supposed to take care of her travel to the village. And uh, where does Ngozi, your sister, live? Hey, she lives somewhere at number 10, uh, Papa, somewhere. Thank you, man. Thank you, my dear. You're welcome. Um, Jack, your brother, was a very good friend of ours. Eh? He was really very nice to us when he was alive. Really? Mm-hmm. Please stay hearts, all right? We'll be coming from time to time to see you. Is it part of the money you are owing him? You are owing some money. I believe so. All of it is for you. What is this for me? Yes. Ha! And of course, you can be sure of getting more of this from where that came from. Really? Ha! My dear brother, I thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. Sister, thank you. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right.
So what do we do now? Obviously, Juno is in trouble. Can anyone tell me what this is all about? I don't know. I really don't know. Can you imagine they came to kidnap him in my name? I'm surprised the way things are going. Since my house is being under safe for you, and uh, Angela is always busy, can he come and stay with you today? My house? No, Juno cannot come and stay in my house. Please, can you take him with you? Stay with me? No. I don't know what his father got himself into, and I don't want to be part of it. This is it. I think you will protect him more than I can do this. Brother, brother, why are you very antagonistic when it comes to Brother Jack? After all, he is dead. Can't you just forget it? What did he do for me and my brothers and sisters? Oh, oh, he sent you to the university and through his influence, he gave me a good job. What of all of us? What did he do to all of us? No problem. I'll take you with me. No, you can't shoot your message. Show them the picture, isn't it? Yeah, they have the pictures with them. Good. That is the girl. Yeah. And that's the boy. If you get that boy alive, you get double of this. You can come to North Chief. And remember, we want the boy alive. We don't make mistakes. I hope so. Thanks, Chief. We're ready, Chief. What do you want from me? Somebody is after us not to kidnap my nephew. You've not told me what I want to hear. I said, who are you and what do you want from me? Reacting when you still have a way out. The way out? Did I hear you say the way out? Like, oh, tell me which way out? The only way out. 
only way out right now is giving them another chance. Yes, Chief. One more chance. What one chance, Chief? Listen, boys. The boy in question is very important to us. My colleagues and I are losing our jobs. Our businesses are collapsing by the day. And who knows? We might all begin to die one at a time. It is that simple. All you need to do is get the boy. You will become rich. Simple. You will fail this time, Chief. No matter what it is, you will get the boy alive. You better don't fail this time. You better don't fail this time. Of course we will. Trust us. Very sure. safe here. Now, I'm a policeman. I was simply touched by your story, that's all. Thank you very much, sir. Um, but we just have to leave. I'm making arrangements for us to leave town. Yes, sir. Okay. And what about Junior? Why don't you let him stay here while you go out there and make all the necessary arrangements to leave town? Uh, no, oh. but... Oh, no, Angela, you don't need to be scared. You trusted me for a night, and I didn't disappoint you. I can protect him. Trust me. Just trust me. Can you tell me I can make a arrangement? I'll make a message for things for me, okay? Thank you, sir. Yes, okay. Um, Angela, you see your car is parked uh, two streets from here? Yes, sir. For security purposes, I will advise you not to get close to that car. They might still be around watching. Chifuba, you're welcome. Thank you very much. Chifuba. He's actually your late brother's uh, managing director in one of his companies in Port Harcourt. Really? Yeah. Uh, Chifuba, this is uh, OK here, like I told you. Okay. Jack's elder brother. Good day, sir. So, my brother has the company in Port Harcourt. Yes. <laughs> Good day, sir. Welcome, sir. Welcome, sir. Oh, come on. I should be the one to address your sir, please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. Actually, like uh, Chief Eze just said, I am Chief Oba, the managing director of your brother's company in Port Harcourt. You see, your brother had a lot of companies, a business a empire, both in Nigeria and outside the country. So, so I'm taking care of the one in Portacot. So, my brother had a company in Portacot? Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So when uh, Chief uh, Eze told me about everything, I said, let me also come and see. That's why we're here. You're welcome, my dear. So, how is uh, Jack Jr., the little boy? 
The boy is fine, he's fine. Oh, oh yes, that, that, that reminds me. Um, we, we heard that some people are threatening his life. How far is that true? Yes, that is true, Chief. Uh, that was that even made our family. Uh, we had a meeting last week over the issue. We had a family meeting uh, to discuss that matter. In fact, we are confused. We don't know what is happening. Oh, oh please, sir. Uh, do apologies. Do apologies. You see, actually, we are supposed to be responsible for the upkeep and safety of that boy. Yes. All right. And uh, the boy being in trouble might be connected with his father's businesses. What do, you, what do you think? It's true. Uh, 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 Uncle, see, you see, your brother, your late brother, Jack, was very, very good to us. In fact, as I am now, he met me. Mm -hmm. Good. He met me. So the upkeep of Junior is very, very important to us. We, we want to train him to grow to a stage where he can take over his father's company. Mm -hmm. And we also want you to be in the know of what goes on in the company. Yes, sir. What, what we are trying to say is that... Um, for now, all right, while the ball remains in your care, all right, we are going to work out modalities on how you are going to take over the entire company that belongs to your late brother, Jack. We take over the company? Oh, oh yes. 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 And as a matter of fact, sir, we came with a token for his upkeep so that you can really take care of uh, this, this is a token of uh, 100000 for Junior's upkeep. Let's take it. You keep this, you know, uh, 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 it is strictly for the boys up okay. here, all right? When we come back next time, we're going to come with all the documents relating to all the companies your brother owns within the country and even outside, so you can start from there. Well, uh, I'll go and discuss with members of my family. I think uh, as soon as we finish that meeting, I'll let you people know what's in our position. Thank you very much. May God bless you people. Thank you. Eh? Yeah, please, eh? Thank you very Just much. go ahead and uh, as soon as that is done, please get back to us. Okay. While we work out modalities on how um, to take over the upkeep and safety of uh, Junior. And uh, Uncle, I hope wherever Junior is right now, he is very safe. Yes, he is safe. And again, nobody knows where he is. No, nobody knows except in that of my family alone. Good. Please let it remain like that. We can do that. Uh, uncle, you see, the safety of Junior is very, very important to us. Oh, yes. Because if anything happens to him, Jack, your brother, no, won't be happy in his way at all. Thank so you please make sure his safety is guaranteed until we're able to take over. It's okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. So, uh, we'll do it as much as possible. Thank you. Thank Just